guys, welcome to Enigma 77 Reviews. So I've had a delivery today, <coughs> excuse me. Um, I know what it is because I've opened it and I'm quite excited to share. So a little bit of a story beforehand. So as you know, my channel has now gone to alternative. You wonder why I've got my hood up. It's goddamn freezing in this conservatory. Um, I think I may have to change my room come like winter time, guys. I think I'll struggle in here. But I... Um, I'm now like doing alternative on my channel and I like to support a lot of small businesses. As you know, I've been supporting Majestic, which is um, a gothy kind of shop that's opened in the town where I live. Um, and I like to support the YouTube, uh, other YouTubers as well, guys, because it costs nothing. Do you know what I mean? It, it's just an act of kindness and um, it's nice to have the support on board. And I think it's important, to be honest with you guys, to support each other. There's too much of this um bitching and hating and stuff like that so for that reason i'm not into that so my channel is based on what i want to share with you guys and supporting everybody so i seen um this lady for the very first time on youtube so i never knew she had a, her own little store or anything like that and obviously i've been adding alternative um well i've had a few alternative kind of youtubers on my channel but I thought I'll have a look at a few others. So I found this YouTuber and <coughs> I liked her style. It was very, very quirky. She's very, very young compared to the likes of me. And um, I just liked her style and everything else. And it just, it made me look back like me as a young child wanted to be so different and like my friends weren't. So I tried to always fit into the crowd at the time. I could never actually be myself until I got older. So I found her website on YouTube and her name is Simply Spooky. So then I found out that she, um, in fact, I seen um, Simply Gothic on Instagram and I didn't realise it was the same person. So I added it on Instagram and um, and then it connected to Facebook. And then I realised that she actually does handmade jewellery. And I was really impressed with the kind of jewellery that she did. It was the way that the necklace hung down. The ch it wasn't just the, the pendant itself. It was the way the chain was. I just think it was very elegant, like, like a choker style, but it, like a droplet. And I just thought, oh wow. So I went onto her store, cut the long story short, and had a look. And I just loved what she did, her ideas and everything. So I kind of decided to just buy a couple of things for now, because as we know, Christmas is coming and money is tight. Next year be a total different story. Now I do know that she formed her store in February 2017, so she's been doing it a while. And um, it's called Simply Gothic. I will put all the links underneath. I'll put um, a link to Simply Spooky's YouTube page. I will also link her Instagram business page and normal page. And I'll do the same for her Facebook. So I ordered a couple of pieces from there. And um, they've arrived today. So it's come in this little envelope. And I thought, well, what, the, what the heck could this be? And then when I opened it, I realised what it was. So... Invoice came, <coughs> I ripped it a little bit because I couldn't wait to get in it. So I've ordered two items, guys, and the total, including the shipping, was £11.80, which is pretty much nothing. Now, I'll show you an example of one of my favourite necklaces. I don't tend to wear it too much, but it is one of my favourite necklaces. Now, my mum bought me this about three years ago from a gothic shop. It came in a beautiful case. I've got the case somewhere still. But I've took it out of the case and it's it's like amethyst because it's my birthstone. And I just wanted to show you. I absolutely love this necklace, guys, because I, I tend to just keep to like silver or white gold or um, certain metals because I'm allergic to pu uh, pewter. But when I seen the jewellery that Simple Spooky was doing, I was just like, oh my God, I absolutely love what she's doing. And for a young girl... A young entrepreneur why wouldn't you want to support her so <coughs> let's get stuck in so it came in this beautiful wrapped up bag and it's got a little pumpkin um tape on the side and then she's put her card on here so i'm gonna put my glasses on guys i'll take my hood down now so i'll just put my glasses on i'm just really cold let me just pull her card out so oh bless her so this is the card 
and I think it's called Kirsty actually. I do remember when I was doing it on PayPal, it came up as Kirsty. So it says, thank you, enjoy your jewellery, YouTube, Simply Spooky, Kirsty. So it says, Simply Gothic Co, handmade gothic jewellery, www.simplygothic.co.uk and she's on Etsy, so it's www.etsy.com slash uk slash shop slash Simply Gothic Co. And she's also on Instagram and it's simply underscore gothic. And I've also got her email address. So for a young entrepreneur, well done, because that is just amazing. That card is amazing. And I love the um, the, the little witchified lady sat in the moon. So let's get on. So she's wrapped it up, bless her. I feel like I'm doing my occult thing again, but in the daytime. <laughs> Oh, bless her. So she's put them in organza. I love organza bags. My husband said, you're obsessed with organza bags, you. I said, I don't know. Oh, bless. So here's one of them. And it's in a beautiful pumpkin orange bag. Oh, that's so cute. And then there's another one here. Oh, bless. So she's put all little confetti in. I didn't see all that. Let me just pull it out, guys, so you can see. Ah, it's all on my desk. I love it. And I'll keep all that on my desk. So she, she well packaged it guys, I mean it's not exactly like um, breakable but <laughs> she's put spiders in. So guys you know I don't like spiders but I don't mind these little things, they're quite cute. If I didn't have my glasses on I'd kind of be a bit freaked out seeing it on my table. And there's little pumpkins as well, oh they're cute, thank you Kirsty. So I'm just going to put them on my desk because I'm going to keep them, they're cute. I might scatter them on my unit actually. So not one but two pieces guys and I can't wait to see what's inside of these. So I think she's sim simply talented, never mind simply gothic. So she's put them inside a bag as well and she's put the sticker on them. Well thought of, well packaged, well done, love it. So I like how she's put like the atomical kind of leaves on because we are in the month of what are we in september jesus it's actually october tomorrow kitchen halloween starts tomorrow guys oh omg so guys this one is mine the other one is a gift but let me just show you oh wrong way rachel oh my lord so guys i do have a necklace upstairs that's similar to this kind of wing not the chain and um, I do wear it from time to time, but I wanted a piece that I could wear like this piece, but I can just swap and change. So I got the fairy kind of wing, angel wing. Absolutely love it. And as you can see, the necklace is quite a good sturdy necklace. You can actually tighten it to whatever. You could have this as a choker if you wanted to, or you could have it drop from the middle down. And then it has like a little round clasp here then a tiny little black bead that is amazing absolutely amazing i like that so i don't know if that'll fit around my fat head and i don't like wearing more, more than one necklace because i find that they get tangled up and i have broken loads before by doing that let me just fasten her up this is amazing right let me just hook her in and it's easy clasp as well guys because i um have arthritis in my hands and I absolutely love the occult necklaces. I'm just struggling a little bit getting them like open. But my husband said he'll do it for me. So if I just move my Ouija one out of the way, you get to see. Let me just get my mirror. That is absolutely amazing. I absolutely love that. And I mean, I really do love that. And then you could just have them. That is amazing. So that's my first piece, guys. Now, this one cost £4.80. £4.80, so it's a gothic bird wing, but I would class this more of like an angel wing rather than a bird, although a wing's a wing. Um, there's three left, so if you want to grab one of these guys, I'd get to grab one now. It's Swarovski bead and it's in black, which I think is absolutely amazing, it just gives it that little touch. So that one's that, guys. Now this one's actually a Christmas present for a friend. And, um, oh look. So I love how she's put the Happy Halloween. Even though this is going to be a Christmas present, I'm still going to leave that on there because that is beautiful. So I seen this and straight away I thought, I know somebody who would love this. I'm not going to say the price, guys, because then she'll know. 
but you'll see it on um simpler gothics page she's gonna she's gonna know anyway so it's five pound fifty guys this one and oh my god just look at that guys just look so this one is a black heart with um a cut out bat symbol in the middle shape <gasps> I just love how her necklaces have this drop. Can you understand? Like some necklaces, they'll be on the chain, like so. But this has this like extra drop. So it kind of dangles on your neck, so to speak. Let me just, I'm going to try it on even though it's not. And it's quite light as well, guys. So it's not too heavy. Obviously, this one's a bit heavier because that'll be stainless steel that the wing's on. Let me just pull this off. That is so easy to clasp on and off, guys. I absolutely, oh, Rachel, absolutely love that. We just put that one there. And then this one, obviously it is a gift, but I'm just gonna show you what it looks like on because it wouldn't be fair if I didn't. And it'll probably look really nice against um, red. Right, I'm just gonna tighten it on this one, guys. Let's move that across. Let's move this one out of the way. OMG, that is stunning. Absolutely stunning. Now, there's two left in stock for these guys. So if you do want to get one, I'd go and grab one. I'm kicking myself that I didn't get one of these for me because that is amazing. Now, I know that she does um, like wolves on there and pumpkins, spiders, skeletons, skulls, you name it. The old gothy and the weird and wonderful is on there and extremely affordable, guys. I think it's amazing what she does. But that is stunning. Absolutely love that. And I'm sure a certain person will love that as well. I'm going to put it back in this bag. Okay, guys. So I probably will be doing a lot more of the jewellery hauls next year because I think these are absolutely amazing for gifts as well. I'm going to actually put this one in the orange organza bag. Even though it's for Christmas, it still has the weird and wonderful theme. So there you go. So guys, I'll pop all the information of Kirsty's um, details at the bottom. I um, I don't know. I don't know if my girls like this kind of thing. I know my 16 year old doesn't, but I think my 21 year old is I mean, She likes the alternative things as well. So she'd probably like um, one of these necklaces. So I'm going to have another look. She does do a subscription box, apparently, guys, that I've just noticed. Um, I'm not too sure on the prices. I think it's something around 9 99 But I'll pop all the information on below. Go and check her out. Go and support her YouTube channel as well, which is Simply Spooky. And um, you'll get to see all the amazing things that she does. She does cloth hauls, makeup hauls, the weird and wonderful hauls. And she probably will showcase some of her jewellery. She does wear a lot on her, on her neck, so you'll get to see. And, like, her earrings and stuff. So, thank you for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this um, small, short kind of review. But I just couldn't resist but showing you. I'm going to go back on now, guys, and see if I can get one of them back ones for me and maybe a wolf one because I think these are amazing. Now, certain necklaces like this I won't wear all the time, guys. Um, I just don't wear a lot of jewellery, to be honest, but I do like to have, like, gothic pieces. So when I am going out, like this one, I do wear a lot. But if this, if I was wearing red, this probably wouldn't go with it. At least if I've got a few there, I can pick and choose. All right, guys, <coughs> don't forget to ring the bell if you haven't already. Put your comments on below. Go and check out Kirsty's pages and show a little bit of support. All right, guys, take care of yourself and I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now.